Oh yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another story time video. I do not know what to record about Roblox, so what am I gonna do? I'm, I'm going to be forcing myself to record Roblox? Of course not. My friend yesterday, this is a real story by the way, he kicked me in the nutsack. He ended up taking my phone as well, and guess what happened? Look at this shit. It is absolutely shattered to pieces. I'm gonna make this dude pay me for a new phone. I'm, I'm telling you, man. I'm pissed off. I'm very pissed off. So, uh, there's this girl in my classroom and she sat behind me for the last two or three weeks, if I'm not wrong. And bro, let me tell you, <laughs> she smells like absolute weed. <laughs> you know when you get close to like, a, I, I don't know, a weed plantation or something like that? I mean a weed farm? I have never gotten close to a weed farm to know how it smells like. However, it, it, it that is what she smells. Your grandpa, who has been smoking for the last 70 years of his life, he's 80 years old by the way. That is precisely how she smells like. You know, so naturally, if a person smells like weed, I'm not gonna like it, man, because I'm gonna be real with you. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna drink like a couple of alcoholic beverages, maybe. I'm gonna drink a couple of sodas. I'm gonna drink energy drinks but one thing that my values that i am not um, that i am never going to allow myself to do will be using weed or any drugs you know what i'm saying anyway coming back to the story so she sat behind me for the last two weeks and the smell was terrible the smell was literally uh, every breath like this you would feel the weed bro and that was making my nose kill itself and yesterday was the last day that she sat uh, behind me so what did I what did I think I was like man I kind of want revenge on this girl you know what I'm saying I want revenge for the irreparable damage that she's done to my nose I forgot about it for a second what did I do <laughs> man I ripped out the worst smelling and the longest fart of my life and that is not a joke, dude. The fart smelled like my bathroom when I have diarrhea. So you you do not even know how bad it smelled. <laughs> but it was better than the smell of weed, man. I'm gonna be blatantly real with you. It was so much better than the smell of weed. The fart literally took like 10, 15 minutes to phase out completely, you know what I'm saying? And it would look sometimes like behind like this. And I would see her going like... <laughs> And, and I could not do anything but laugh, bro, because this girl, on top of being the biggest weed smoker I've ever met in my life, she also, first of all, makes fun of people when they cry for whatever reason, like someone is not doing too well on the day, she's gonna be like, haha, you're so weak and stuff like that. And second of all, like last week, I believe last Thursday, uh, it was a student's day. And we were supposed to receive a little candy, you know, like just a hey, happy student's day and stuff like that. Only the boys were in physical education at that moment when we got the candies. And when we came back, the candies were not there. That girl stole the candies, bro. And this is not speculation because not to brag, but I have some woman friends in my classroom. And I asked them, did you see someone who stole uh, the boys candies? And they said, all, all of them said, bad girl, you know, like the weed smoker and the fart smeller. So she's done a lot of bad stuff. You know, she's not a really good human being. Today at Spanish class, uh, the teacher was like uh, giving us some exercises, playing some music for us and stuff. And while she was playing music, she got the phones of everyone who had their phones like over their table, you know. Even if the people were not using it, just like as a joke, you know. Like it, it, was, literally, it was literally a joke because she returned uh, the phones to them after the class had ended. Not, a re not really a big deal. One of the people who had their phone taken away was the fart smeller, you know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ah, you know what I'm saying? And you cannot imagine how happy I was. When I saw, man, th this might come off as the top 10 worst assholeries of the century. However, I, I, left, I, I left out so hard when the Spanish teacher took out her phone, you know? Because she was crying there. She started crying because <laughs> the teacher took her phone away and she's 17 years old, man. That was the highlight of my year, dude. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not one to prey on people's downfalls. You know what I'm saying? But if it's that girl, that specific girl, she annoys me up to such a level that, dude, it is uncontrollable hatred. If I had to choose an arch enemy for my life, it would be the fart smeller. I'm just really happy that she got what she deserved at the end of the day. You know, and the good people such as me right here, this 
angel of a of a human being i'm just being treated like a god man i'm just kidding i am not this was really just the story time that i wanted to tell you guys because i find i i, I kind of found the story really interesting today to tell you i do not know what to talk about in roblox man like what am i gonna say oh new limiteds again bro i'm, I'm kind of tired of that i'm not gonna lie subscribe to my youtube channel join my discord server activate the bell and do whatever you want but please support me man i'm begging for your support